Hello everyone and welcome to the private pilot maneuver series. Today we are going to do a soft field takeoff which basically means taking off from a soft field or a grass field. Before I go into the cockpit, please make sure you leave a like on the video, please subscribe to the channel, it really helps the channel grow and helps with my motivation to make these videos. With that out of the way, let's get into the cockpit here. Okay, so one of the main things that you remember on soft field takeoff is that you never break. I just turned into this runway, but I did not break. I just let the airplane stop itself. Ideally, you would not even stop. You would just keep rolling so that the wheels don't get dug into the ground. Okay, so let me do a quick debrief on what we are going to do on this takeoff. So we'll start rolling. Uh, we will pull our yoke while we roll so that uh, we can we can get off the ground as soon as possible right above the stall speed and then we'll stay in the ground effect and gain the speed up to 75 knots we are still doing flaps of five so we'll gain the speed up to 75 knots and then go into a stable climb take the flaps out once the v speed is positive and then stabilize the climb at 75 knots so let me show you so that it's not as confusing as it is right now when i talk about it Slowly giving it throttle and uh, getting it rolling. No brakes, remember. And always keep your yoke pulled up when you're taxiing on a soft field. Okay, just waiting for a good lineup here. And then let's go full throttle. Right throttle to keep us on the center line. And I still have my yoke pulled up so that we can get off the ground as soon as possible there we are and then keep it in the ground effect maybe like 10 20 feet above the ground keep gaining speed so there's 75 knots start climbing make sure you don't drop the speed too much keep it at roughly 75 Okay, so 75 knots, we have positive V speed, flaps can come up. And then once flaps come up, you will uh, see that you'll start speeding up. So you adjust your attitude to still keep a 75 knot best rate of climb speed. Nice, so once it's stabilized here, you can trim the aircraft to relieve the control pressure. And uh, that will put you in a nice 75 knot climb. Okay, so that's how you do a soft field takeoff. If I miss something, as usual, please let me know in the comment section and I'll pin that comment. Hope you guys enjoyed that video and I will see you on the next one.